in this little box we have an itemizer. It says itemizer for the calculating woman. It's uh, it's a small uh, adding machine, and it's it intended for uh, shoppers. It has a, a strap and yeah, a, a dial like a combination lock, a safe lock. On the side here are, are two windows. Those show the uh, current uh, current total, and, and this knob is used for adding. To add a number, you first press this button in the center that locks this front knob onto the uh, register and you turn it to uh, until you see the number you want to add, say 45 then you uh, push the button back from the, from the rear and the uh, knob on the front should uh, automatically spring back to, to the zero and the result, as shown here, is 45. And then you uh, can add another number. You press the button, add 70. And now it says 115. You can also subtract, and then you do the uh, same movements, but in the opposite direction. I mean, in the opposite order. So first you uh, put the knob onto the number you want to subtract, then you push the button, then you turn it back to zero, and you release the button. As you can see, uh, it does say 35, but the, when you subtract, it doesn't really properly do the carry uh, as well. Carry does work, but it's it doesn't really display the right number here. To reset, you can you lift this uh, this key here, and uh, here with this you can turn it directly to to zero. On the box. It says itemizer for the calculating woman and here it says Clemens Joyce merchandise marked in Chicago, Illinois. The merchandise mart is a huge building, one of the largest buildings in the world and uh, yeah presumably they had this uh, one store inside there, Clemens Joyce. The patent for this uh, adder was f f made in um, 1954 by George Clemens, presumably the man behind this uh, company. George Clemens has lots of other patents, but they're uh, almost all for toothbrushes and the like, also for a hairdryer. But uh, yeah, this is his only adding machine. So that was the itemizer for the calculating woman. Thank you for watching.